Hello, Miss Tidwell's first graders. How about some teaching time with Miss Tidwell? Outside right now, I was thinking we could have a little science lesson. So I walked across the street from my house and across the street, I have this area here. And I was looking and enjoying and thought about how pretty it looks and all the different things that happen in this habitat. I've seen a small alligator here, lots of birds, many dragonflies. I've seen fish jumping and I thought it would be a great spot to just come and share this view with you. And maybe we see a few things around that might be incredible or just a lovely different spot to look at. I spy with my little eye a bird right here. Do you see it right there? It's kind of far away. I think it might be a heron from this area, but it could be something else. Let's see if we can find that little baby gator in here. Remember, you can take a look at anything out and around your house. If you are out exploring, make sure you're with a grown-up. Don't go anywhere near here by yourself. But just stop and look and enjoy. You never know what you might see. You never know what you might find. There's beauty. Oh, I just heard a splash. Right there where the water is rippling. But there's things to notice all around you. Just stop and take a minute to enjoy the things that are around. It sounds and looks like a peaceful day. If you can hear the birds around me. heard another splash this direction and the ripples in the water but not quick enough to be able to show it seeing this makes me think about the day that we took our walk with Miss Tonight and we were able to notice things that we found in nature and then you drew and labeled those things in your notebook you can do the same things like what we did on that day in your own yard, in your own neighborhood, on your own street. It doesn't have to be a view like this. Trees, grass, butterflies, things that you spy. Stop and enjoy the moment. I'm not going to spend much longer here. And it doesn't look like I spy with my little eye that alligator. But maybe the next time I bring up... Oh, boys and girls. I do think I see it. Okay, let me see if I can zoom in. Definitely something right there that's going through the water. It's gliding right across the water. I think that's that alligator. I'm not going to stay too long too close, but I definitely think that's it. Yep, that's it. There's the alligator right there. It's small. You know, Miss Tidwell is not a fan of alligators, so I won't stay put too long, but we'll video it just a little bit longer. See, I'm still kind of far away from it. Where I am, here's my feet, all the way to where it is. 
Aaron's like me. He does not like alligators, but there it is right there. We just watched it just swim right across. Let me see. Right here. Hopefully that's as close as he's going to get to. I don't think they like being too close to people. And Miss Tidwell's definitely not one of those people that like it being too close to her. Sure would be interesting if we could watch him enjoy a tasty snack. Or get a little bit different of a view of him, but that's him. That's the alligator that lives in the little um, swampy area right here across from my house. I'm going to see if I can walk and just to get a different view of that alligator. It almost looks like he's turning his face just a little bit. Is he letting us get a view of him? Right there. Hello, Mr. Gator. I'll watch you from right here. And so will my students. I hope he enjoys his day out in the bright sunshine. Just like you might be enjoying your day. Oh, there he is. You see him? He turned straight on. It looks like he's facing me and looking right at me. All right, it is time to say goodbye to this gator. Boys and girls, you enjoy your day? Do something fun and special? Huh, if I'm looking right here, I can find different things of learning all around me. If I had a marker, a pencil right here and drew a line right across, that looks like it's my line of symmetry. Everything that's at the top here is just like what's below. There's my line of symmetry. Why is it like that? Because of the reflection. The reflection on the water makes it look like on the water everything here that we see above. Have a great day. Miss Tidwell misses you all. Enjoy your day. Bye.